Hey, happy Tuesday, Extreme Gang. We are here with a little mail day action. So, these are both from Breaks. I'll have another mail day Thursday with some cool stuff for you guys to see. This package here came out of the Monster's Den, where I do break at, along with getting to Breaks. So you guys are always welcome to check that out. Hmm. I hit the Pelicans in a random optic break. Uh, take a look at it here. Well, good old Pug is behind me. She's like, what's up? What are we doing? There wasn't a whole lot of bang, <laughs> whether or not for the Pelicans in this case. But there's enough to get graded and make some money. I think uh, random teams, it was under 100 bucks because he had some combo teams. I want to say was around 95, something like that, 26 spots, so kind of lucked out. And where are those? They're hanging out. Alrighty. So these are just the base out of it all. Jackson Hayes. I'm actually going to kind of sort that because Jackson Hayes is doing pretty good. Hmm? Sure about Ingram being there. Another Jackson Hayes. Three, four, five Jackson Hayes rookies. Alrighty, let's take a look here. I try to make sure these are kind of sorted so we can look at this stuff. And boom. All right. So we hit three of these. These are the Zion Williamson all. Wow, I can't even read. All clear for takeoff. This one here is actually a hollow compared to the other ones. Kind of a little bit hard to see. You can kind of tell when I go like this, the coldness on. Plus you got the Prism logo right down there. Bam. We hit three of the rookies as I on. They look pretty good. Stuff will all go get graded. One optic hollow from the rookies. And what you see on there is just fuzz from the case, so it looks like it's in pretty good condition to get graded. Centering might be a little bit off, but we're going to give it a chance and hopefully maybe comes back a nine left to right. Man, I can't want the camera. I just had it too. There we go. And then we had four rated rookies in the whole thing. And those were selling pretty decent too, actually. So those will get graded. We hit a pink Velocity, I believe they're still calling these, Nikhil Alexander uh, Walker. That is numbered out of 79. And a straight blue Jackson Hayes Prism. Numbered out of 59. That will go get graded. So not too bad for the Pelicans. I mean, it's a lot of work on that to get your, you know, get money onto it and stuff. So it's all down the road. Next, this was a five case break of top series one. It was three cases jumbo, two cases hobby. I took the Cincinnati since I'm really close to them. Um, they sell really well for one, plus Aquino was a rookie. I have no idea what I got in this because I could not watch that long of breaks. Like he started breaking us on Friday and finished Sunday, and it took him to Saturday to sort all this stuff and get it out. So if you guys, what's it called the Golden Scalpel Breakers, they're on Facebook. So let's take a look at this. So you can see how it comes packaged and everything. You guys can always make your own choices who you break with. We'll take a look though. I give everybody a chance and we see how it goes. I kind of like the multi cases because you kind of get a good chance at stuff. Right, let me see. I think that might be opening. All right, now, let's 
That side's good. Alrighty. <laughs> Yeah, he wrote me a note just basically saying sorry for delay. Take a couple, you know, ten bucks off next break, which I will. I'll probably get in Heritage with him. So, I'm guessing this is the high numbers. Try not to knock off anything back there. Maybe not. Oh, boy, I got to look for variation codes. 269. I don't know what they were. No. All right. Oh, why Winkler's in there? So we got one Aquino. We might have just had him set that way. We're basically looking for Aquino. That's pretty much the given right here. And these are all his tops rookie cards. So there's two. Senzel, who would be a future star. His stuff's pretty much not going to be worth a lot, even if you grade it. Of course, my phone just wants to go off like hi. All right, let's take a look here. It's taking me a second to figure out this and how he did this, the packaging. Do get a nice little 25 counter. Okay, that looks like that's all hits in there. I'm going to skip, oh, he's going every which way. I'm going to skim through these pretty quickly. I'm just going to pull out my Aquinos because, yep, that's who I'm grading. Be on one of them large submissions. And if you're a Reds collector, is that numbered? And of course, I got the pug, like, directly under me, just... Being a fool. Hey, stop. Oh, yeah, I could say I wish you to put the Aquinos in something. But a lot of people don't think the same way I do with, uh, you know, guys are grading this stuff, so you want to case some of the top rookies out. We got plenty of kinos to go around. I will say that. There's another one. I was hoping there was a variation, so I don't want to touch the top loaders to the end. This won't take me too long, hopefully. So we already have a nice stack of kinos right there. But I'll tell you, this was a long break for anybody that ever wants to see five cases of tops. Another Aquino. Another one. Another one. I mean, if he does well, you know, it could be once you spend $11 or $10 to grade them and stuff. Could be. Pretty nice uh, addition, just like, uh, gosh, I can't even think of the Blue Jays, dude. Man, I'm burnt from work. I'm sorry, guys. Bichette and Alvarez for the Astros. I think a lot of people are looking for Kyle Lewis, uh, Mariners as well. Lux for the Dodgers. See, now it's all coming to me, and I start thinking baseball cards. No variation of a Kino yet. I don't think I had an auto of him either. I don't remember seeing it in his post. That looks like top loaded. 
from the Joey Weston stuff down in there. All right, we'll take a look. I'll tell you what, I won't keep you guys bored with me going through Aquinos, but through half of it, I'm looking at 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. That's 20 Aquinos. I probably got at least another 10 to 15 in there so you guys can see what I'm about to pay. Alrighty, these here are all sleeves. These are the tops chromes, or the tops chromes. Wow, the tops out of the packagey thing. You see, I'm done today. So what? There's four Aquinos reds. There's another regular uh, 35th. So we got some golds here, Castillo, or these are the foils, I'm sorry, or gold, whatever you want to call them. But these are foils. Come on, Aquino, be in here, buddy. No. Yikes, we might not have done well on this. Uh, looks like those are jersey actions there. What if Johnny Benches... Man, I wish I could have to look. I think these are variations, possibly. Oh, come on. Here we go. I believe those are variations. I don't remember where I saw these at in there. Let me look at the back of one of these here. Yeah, they are. It's 294. So either these are high series or variations. Pretty cool, though, with Bench. We got a Nick Senzel double jersey action. Oh, I'm sorry, just one. Oh, no, it's two Senzel. I'm sorry, I was reading that there. So, jersey actions, not too bad. I think it's really like 150 bucks. So, this here, like, it's banking a lot on Aquino, to be honest. Barry Larkin, wood piece. Not numbered. I don't know why that's the case. Uh, two ninety nine, okay, Larkin. That's out of three hundred. I guess it's one of the Nevado Blue. So we did decent. I'll put this stuff in the store if anybody wants it. Um, it'll go in a stack. I was just a Kino hunting. I'm not going to keep going through looking for Kinos right now because it would just be a long video. But I'm guessing there's probably going to be, like I said, another 15 Aquinos. This is pretty cool to hold these for right now. They will go out to get graded. Actually, all these will. Because if he does anything good like Soto or somebody out there does, you know, you make your money back. That's what you bank on is the rookies. All right, guys. Thank you for watching this mill day. I know there was a little bit longer when everybody wanted offhand. do apologize for that. You guys can hear the pug behind me snoring away. Tomorrow we'll be back with another video Thursday. I think tomorrow we're going to cover out a bunch of questions onto uh, what we do in the store. So we'll do like a little Q&A thing. Thursday will be a quick mail day. Friday. We got the giveaway video. It'll go up. We'll go live for an hour from 9 to 10 with a special code for the store so you guys can buy some cards out of the store. And then we'll have a couple breakages actions. I believe my select football boxes are already gone. I have a 1718 retail prism. Uh, I won a 1920 optic basketball. So it'll be some cool stuff for this weekend. All right, guys, I'm not going to keep blabbing because I'm really tired from work, and I will just keep going at it here. <clears throat> guys, have a good night. Don't forget to always subscribe to the channel, like the video, and make some comments. Check out the store, ExtremeCarBreaks.com, where you can get your stuff a little bit cheaper on eBay. Talk to you all later.